Dare to dream, dare to believe, dare to think, dare to work. Only then do you achieve. Motani, sign You cannot up. live very long without having a wound. It may be a wound from an accident. That is a physical wound. It may be a wound that you inflicted on yourself. Or it may also be a wound that came from the fault of others. It may be a wound from a relationship, maybe a partner, a friend, a loved one who left you. The pain burns day in, day out within you. Somebody you thought will always be there to protect you. Somebody you thought will always be there for you to rely on. Somebody you thought was your all and all. Somebody you thought was an angel in front of you, could do you no harm, ended up hurting you, ended up causing you pain. And though they are long gone, away from your life, you still from time to time think about it and you've allowed yourself to feel the pain. You still from time to time look at that mark and you remember the pain, the hurt you went through. Someone you thought will always be there for you, who promised to always be there for you, and who wanted to always be there for you, ended up dying. Someone, some of these wounds sometimes heal up, heal up with time, but soon, some of them are so deep while others heal up and you find no evidence there are wounds you've had from injuries you've encountered in your life that after some time you see you don't feel them again and even the mark is not there so you cannot even remember them but there are some of these wounds that are deep there are some of these wounds that are so deep the pain you felt was so intense that even after the wound got healed up even after the person left the scar remains. The scar remains. The scar might have come from you falling from a bike. The scar might have come from an operation you encounter to remove an illness. An operation you encounter to give birth to a child. The scar may be physical or it may be invisible, maybe emotional, maybe psychological scars that you've gone through. The scar may have come from some words someone offered for, for, for offered to you. And when you think about those words, it pains you. It hurts you. The scar may have come from the mistakes you've made in your life. We are saying today, let those scars make you better and not bitter. Let those scars push you to do better for the future and not just sit around and say it's done and dusted. I can't do anything to change it.